Hey everyone, Kalibi here. Welcome back to my channel. Sorry this video is getting up a little bit late. It's just holidays and everything. It's been hectic, of course, but Happy New Year, you guys. This is super exciting. My birthday is actually tomorrow. My cat is opening the door. That's a bit creepy. <laughs> I promise I'm not squeezing her. She's just, she makes those noises. Um, anyways, this will be part two of the Christmas day and Eve vlog. Not too much vlog, but I have like videos of me opening gifts and the gift haul and everything. It's going to be really fun. Again, check out the first Christmas vlog I did because I'm having two Christmases with two different parts of my family. So let's just get into it. And this is one of the new things I got. It's really cute. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Oh, it is Olivia. Yeah. yeah. This one. Cute. You're the Yeti. A tag though. I actually cut it off. Oh, did you keep the tag I though? I think I did. Yeah, okay, still. Cute. Yeah, I was clipping, you know, because I clipped tags off when I wrapped present. What? Where are you going? Looks like Kitty wants a present, so she's going to get to open one tonight for Christmas Eve. No peeking, Kitty. Come downstairs. Open it, kitty. Get it. Oh my god. A bit of self promo, but again, if you haven't seen the first part, make sure to check it out and see what else I got in my first Christmas. Christmas. Oh my god. There's an absolutely no way. I thought I lost these, but literally editing this, I saw that I put them in the cup holder. It's calcite. Almost like a tower almost. Oh, my trinkets. Yeah. Jennifer Lawrence. That is so cute. <laughs> Kitty. Being held against her will. <laughs> you, I mean, you can't escape me. Time for stockings. We should have done it earlier, but we forgot. Christmas tree squishmallow clip. I picked out this little cutie and my grandma got it for me. She's so cute. Yeah, it's an Itania with Margot Robbie. Iconic. Blade candy cane. Oh yeah, that was good. Candy canes. Candy. Wonder Woman. Here are a few of the highlights from my stocking. It's super cute. I will do an in-depth haul in a separate little short video. Okay. Are you recording? Yeah, obviously. There's Raven Box. Did you go to the Edgar Allan Poe then? No, I did not. Now this stuff is out of the tree yet. She was just like, I didn't do it. Okay, oh, not that good to Another box of my trinkets. <laughs> I think this box was one of my favorites, super cute, and then they had a bunch of little boxes inside that I could open up, and they had little gifts inside. Not all of them, just a couple. And so here is the first bracelet that I got. I got another one, and this one might be pink sandstone, I'm not certain. So here are the first two I got, and then I'm checking which boxes are empty, which are full. And this one has another bracelet inside. I believe this one is Howlite. We have one more box to open, you guys. These are super cute and wrapped nicely, and they fit so well in this box. 
And the last one is Sodalite, and I love Sodalite. All right, you guys, next up, I got some bugs. Oh my gosh, I love them. I love this specific candle. Pretty okay, you guys, so here's one of my favorite gifts I get every year. Well, we started the tradition last year, but I'm really excited for a new addition to my collection. Look how pretty these pinned butterflies are. Oh no, I ripped the boxes. It's okay, it doesn't matter. This squishmallow, they're ornaments. Leave it on the tree. Hey. Right. Leave those in the box? Um, like I could, but at this point, the box takes up a lot of space, so I don't. In other words, it's collection. Yeah, but I, I'll just pick it out anyways. Some people might keep it in the box. Yes. That's it. My favorite. Actually, the deer is. Darla the deer. Alright, time to make some homemade eggnog, you guys. This stuff is a thousand times better than the stuff you can find in store. It is so delicious, and it's not super rich or thick. It's perfect. And look how cute these little glass cups are for the punch bowl. Oh my gosh. I got this mug for Christmas and look how cute it is. I love Johanna Parker. Okay, you guys, so here is Salem's little kitty Christmas gift haul. So she got some treats, a catnip toy, the little moving mouse roller, and a couple other toys. She adores these catnip toys. Okay, everyone, so here is my Christmas haul from part two, remember, because I had two Christmases with two different parts of my family. So I'm really excited, again, really thankful for everything, and yes, everything is amazing, and I have one more gift to open up for you guys on camera. All right, everyone, so we have one last Squishmallow gift to open up, and yeah, you can kind of see what is inside. I don't think my grandma noticed that and I didn't until like a second ago but I'm really excited to see this is a really cute bag from like Bath and Body Works sparkly so let's get opening our last Squishmallow that we got this year my cat got into this one that's why it's all like mangled oh my gosh and there are some pieces of chocolate coal in here I guess I deserve coal um but here it is here is the last cutie the last squishmallow that i got for christmas so this one does not have a tag and i remember it not having a tag in store when i found it earlier this year my grandma decided to get it for me as a gift and i said it's fine that it does not have the tag so i am really excited for this cutie i do not have this peppermint in any form so i'm super excited and it is one of the cuter christmas squish this one you can have out with your other foodie squish because I think it's that like universal, you know? So here's the last squish I got, a little eight inch mint. So cute. And I will now add it to everything that I got. Okay, so now this is officially everything that I got for Christmas since I got to open the cute little mint. So stinking adorable. So I am really grateful for all the squishmallows I got as well as like all the candles and everything. So I will quickly do a haul and review and there's also a whole bag of stocking stuffers and another squish that i got in there so that will most likely be in a different video and it will be a shorter one so let's just get into it i will also be doing a separate squishmallow christmas haul and review like where i opened the box set and that because i have that cutie that one and i also got 12 inch auto from christmas part one check it out if you guys haven't already I'm really excited let's get into it a few things are missing like pajamas and socks but they're boring okay so first i have yuri the yeti and in the video my grandma said she did cut off the tag all right you guys so here is the tag so i did end up finding it and of course this one is from last year as you can tell from the design as well as the fact that the squad pick is still there but really exciting i also got a 16 inch of the reindeer and that clip will be in the month-long squish hunt video which will be dropping very soon you guys so if you guys are interested, you can pause and read for Yuri's bio. 
I just have to reattach it, find another little plastic thingy to do that. And then I got this really cute Joanna Parker reindeer mug. I love mugs. I love reindeer and I love Joanna Parker's art style. So I got that. And then I got the super cute pet toy collection set. This was in a little short that I did. My grandma decided to get it for me for Christmas. I'm really excited because this is my first time having a ladybug. So cute. And then I got this DW home candle. These are my absolute favorite candles besides Bath and Body Works. And this one's vanilla bean, one of my favorite smells. And look at the pretty moth on top. And then I got this white barn, which is basically Bath and Body Works. It's iced dragon fruit tea. It smells really nice. And then bergamot waters. Like this is a single wick. And this is a three wick. And then this one is a Costco brand. And it is really nice. If I can find the front, chai tonka. And then the last one I got was Champagne Toast, one of my favorite smells, and For Some Nature, it says, with a bunch of bugs on it. Literally, my grandma knows me so well. I love bugs, as you guys will see in a minute. And then I got my first box set of Squishmallow ornaments. So this is really cute, and I get Avita and Luna. I'm really excited for Darla and the Moose. In reality, these are all my favorite ones, so I'm really excited. This is the box set from Costco, and yeah, really exciting. So. Remember, I will be opening that in a different video. So this box set comes with a moose, Luna, Darla, I'm really excited about, Avery, little Cameron, not sure this dog's name, and potentially Ray or Gordon or some shark, and Evita, really exciting. And then, and then I got a whole set of Vanilla Bean Noel from Bath and Body Works. This is my favorite smells, at least my Christmas favorite. So I got lotion, the foaming soap, the body spray, shower gel, and then this, I got this really pretty, I'm not certain what it is. I knew on day of when I opened it, but my mind is blanking on what it is, but a little rough, like raw tower. So really nice. And then I have to move this to show you guys. I got this really nice wooden box with a tree on it. And I love that. Oh, I love boxes for my trinkets, <laughs> but also I love it. Oh, I love the tree. Moving on, I got one of these bags from Virginia City, and if you guys notice it, it looks very similar to my skull bag that I have that I love so much, and I'm not too religious, but I think this is a really nice design and colors, so, and I really love the size of the bag, so I got that. My grandma got it for me. That was really nice of her, and of course, we just opened this super cute little mint 8-inch squishmallow, and then over here is the bugs. I got this jeweled beetle. Oh my gosh, it is so cute. I'm not certain if it was supposed to be an ornament or something, but it is literally adorable. I cannot wait to display him. And then I got these little fuzzy moth clips. I actually already have one and I like them so much. My grandma got me the other ones in the colors I did not have. So they're really pretty and I'm really excited to clip them somewhere. Oh my gosh. And then I got some crystal bracelets. I'm not sure what this one is. This is a sodalite one of my favorite, and it says believe on it. I got uh, rondonite, potentially, or is that like a pink sandstone? I can't really tell. And then I believe howlite and lava rock, it looks like. So these are really cool. They also say stuff like faith on it, so pretty cool. And then I got this really cute little trinket. It's like a carousel horse, like kind of like crystal, so really pretty. Then I got another box for my trinkets. Um, it has this like uh, dyed um, quartz slab, I believe. And it's just a nice box, so pretty cool. And then I caught this raven box. I am dying. I love ravens, and it's so cute. So you open it up, and I got some crystal bracelets from my favorite crystal store in Virginia City. This is Vertidite, and it's for harmony and strength. Really gorgeous. And then I got a Dalmatian Jasper. This one is for joy and protection, and I love Dalmatian Jasper, you guys. And then I also got this fossilized little sand dollar really nice i got a few other crystals i just literally cannot find them for the life of me right now so i'm not certain where they ran off to well since i found these might as well review them and show you guys up close okay so here's everything that i got here is one of them this is the next one this one is really pretty i really love the crust if you will next i'm pretty sure this one is howlite i actually got a bracelet of this Next is a selenite egg. I really love the egg-shaped crystals and everything. I collect them to put underneath my dragon statue. Here's my boy. See, I already have another selenite egg. So cute. 
All right, this one is so tiny and oh, apparently it was a dollar. So this is the next one. It's more of a flaky one and I have one of these, but I'm not certain what their names are. Usually they come with papers, but I don't know any of their names. Next, I believe this is called a blue tiger's eye, if I'm not wrong. It kind of looks blue, but not so much in this lighting. All right, and here is the last crystal. Really hard to see. It's kind of like a pink purple color. I also got this. I do not know what this one is called. My, my grandma picked these ones up for me, so, but it's really nice, really flaky, but really cool. And then I got this. Again, not certain. The names might come to me while editing, but yeah, really nice. And one last crystal in here is another one I don't know the name of, but it also flaky and gorgeous. I love this color green. Oh my gosh. And in here is a mirror. Moving on, I got this green adventuring stone necklace and it stands for prosperity. Really gorgeous and I love the box it's in. And then I got this set of rings um, by a Terry. Not certain what that is. I believe I'm a size seven, so let's hope they fit me. I really love all the designs. This one right here is my favorite. And of course, green. And then I got the whole Hunger Games series. Oh my gosh, you guys. Katniss Everdeen, or more importantly, Jennifer Lawrence, was my first crush that, like, oh, she's amazing. So I cannot wait to watch all of these movies and look how pretty the DVD covers are. And yes, I do still like the DVDs because I can watch them on, like, my Xbox. So I have them all. And, like, oh, they're so gorgeous. I love the covers. I love her. Next, I caught a Detangler wet brush. I'm super excited, and this is really pretty, like, marble black color. This is my first wet brush, so... And I have curly hair, so I think this will be perfect. I'm really excited about it. And it's a limited edition. Ooh. Next, I got a couple books. This one is a fake book. I really love these. And it has a raven on it. Know thyself, it says. And then it's like a little book you can put stuff in. I have a whole collection of these. And then a couple of these books I picked out at Five Below early in the year, like Your Lunar Code. And this one I'm excited for, Lighting the Wick. It's about the magic of candles. And I love candles. And then I caught, yes, another Edgar Allan Poe book. He is my love. If I were to ever marry a man, it would be Edgar Allan Poe. And last but not least, I got the book of Practical Witchcraft. All right, the next thing I got, I'm gonna try not to get in the picture very much, is this really pretty, let me put it up here. They are little pressed butterflies of different sizes and they're so gorgeous. So I got this one last year for Christmas, kind of hard to see. But those are the ones on there and now i got this one so i can put it up on the other side and i'm really excited it is so gorgeous and unique oh my gosh i'm totally trying to build my collection of bugs obviously see there is another cute little moth guy all right one of the few last things that i got was this really cute uh kyoyo brand sweater oh my gosh i love it and it has what do you call it these like drawstrings on the bottom to pull so that's really cool really cute i love like statement jackets and then i got this sweater really nice quality uh that's the brand Ooh, that's not the brand that is and then i got this sweater as well really cute colors these are like my favorite colors except not so much the pink but i love all these colors and then my grandma picked me up some weird pants but if you guys know me or like know me at all like of what i wear I love me some weird unique jeans, so these are super high rise and premium fabric, but they are really cute. Okay, there's, I think there's one missing, or it's like, anyways, that kind of bothers me. Uh, but besides that, they have stars on them with holes, bottom of them, they're like frayed, really cute, so those are adorable. And then one of the last things, and well, the last thing is another blanket, and it's a tree blanket, you guys, and this is the other side. And yeah, I love trees and green. As you can tell, I also got this green tree blanket this year, but I'm really excited for this. Oh my gosh, I love trees. All right, you guys, so that was the Christmas haul. Really, really grateful, like I said, for everything that I got. Everything is perfect, and I'm really excited about the box set and the candles and everything. Let me know down below, what is your favorite gift that I got? I really love this box, the movies, the box set and all of the candles. I really got a lot of them. 
I had to film this video now so that I can burn one of them. Anyways, I love you guys so much. Don't forget to like, comment your favorite gift, and subscribe for more content like this because I will also be doing a birthday haul, I think. My birthday is literally in like two days on January 3rd. And by the time I post this, it will probably be already my birthday, so we'll see. But I love you guys so much, and I'll see you in the next one. Happy New Year, you guys.